Good morning. We've checked out of our hotel for the day. It's 8.30 in the morning, so we've already wandered. We walked around to Epcot. Um, we've got a lightning lane, or fast pass, what do they call it, genie pass, <laughs> yeah. for um, Frozen at 10 past 10. Yeah. And we've got Guardians of the Galaxy lined up. I think they're estimating around 1 p.m. I'm very excited about Guardians yeah, of the Galaxy. That's one of our favorite Disney coasters. It's, it's fantastic. My favorite Disney coaster by far. Um, so we're gonna get in the park nice and early, and I think maybe go and have a look and see what Test Track's like. Yes, and I've never finished Test Track. And last time we yeah, did, last time we had a, show, a ride stop. And um, lights on, but they still didn't walk us off. So yeah. it's either gonna this time I get to do it, or we well, need a yeah, light show, yeah. show exit. So which one will let you know? <laughs> uh, yeah, take you with us. See you in a bit. So we picked up a Remy's Ratatouille Hide and Squeak. We've already found Australia. Um, we're doing a little search around the park. Um, we've got in on early opening hours, and. It's a delight to walk around the World Showcase with it this quiet uh, and just sort of enjoy the scenery and the architecture for each section. So we entered at the, we entered in France and we walked through England and Canada. Um, it's quite a bit of construction work going on on the World Showcase at the moment, but um, as there has been for years. But it's, yeah, it's really nice to just stroll around the park with it still being quite quiet. Um, I think we're heading either over towards Spaceship Earth or maybe Mission Space. We're not sure which. Um, most people seem to be heading towards Frozen, but we have a fast track for that, so we're not too worried for a minute. So we're on test track, and Lauren's designing a car, or attempting to. Lauren's designed this absolute monstrosity. We'll, we'll see how it does on the competition in a minute. We'll begin with the capability test to see how your vehicle designs perform under challenging weather and surface conditions. Monitoring road surface. Connecting to OnStar. SimCar performance data acquired. <laughs> Let's see how your designs hold up now. Commencing SimCar off-road and extreme weather sequence. Capability test results displayed and verified. Now let's see how your vehicles can go when it comes to their efficiency. <laughs> Commencing responsiveness test. Okay, the responsiveness data is now being synchronized. Automated driving technology verified and active.
really good fun. It was always great. Um, we've taken on ride footage, so that should be in the video as well. 15 um, minutes up until the point at which we start to go. Yeah, and then uh, what, another 15 minutes after that, so half an hour all in, uh, which is great because it's up to an 85 minute wait now, so yeah. it's pretty it's pretty busy. Good shout for the first one in the park, I think, yep. if you're on the magic hours, which I think. Yeah, definitely one to consider coming straight to. Um, we've got about an hour until our um, fast track for uh, Frozen, so I think we're going to go have a look. Yeah. Go have a look at Spaceship Earth, yeah. possibly, and just enjoy a little sit down, uh, chill ride. Yeah, see and see what I'm going to be when I grow up. Like Spaceship Earth, man. Spaceship Earth. One of your favourites, isn't it? Classic. So we've got off Spaceship Earth. Nice little 15-minute sit down in some air conditioning. It's really hot. Uh, this this whole week's very very hot. Yeah. Um, we've, we've Slap loads of sun cream on and uh, trying to hang around in the shade and drink plenty of water. So tell me, what was your future? Uh, I was um, travelling to space in a solar powered car. Now we're off to go and redeem our fast track on Frozen. Frozen which is apparently the, the longest queue in the park. Yeah, it's potentially. So it hopefully we won't be too long waiting for that. Yeah. See what happens. Happy Ever After, um, which was a reskin of Maelstrom years and years ago now. Yeah. Been here for a little while, but it's good. It's decent. It's, yeah, it, it ticks the, the box that Disney needed to. And then it's great for kids. Frozen's still super popular. So, yeah, yeah. it's got a little backwards drop, another small forward drop. We're in the front row. Got a bit wet. So we got a bit wet. I've got a wet bottom. Uh, but really good fun. Um, yeah. So now we're going to take a little walk around to Space 20 and see if we can get a uh, bar seat. We don't have a reservation. So. No, this could this could be a walk straight away again. So yeah. And we're just walking through now the Metsphere area, which is one of my favourite areas in the park. Don't know why. Just really like it through here. So we're just walking into Space 220. Uh, we basically walked in. We're very lucky. We're going straight to the bar for bar seating, but um, yeah, there was one party in front of us, and we're going straight in. which was delightful. It's really nice, isn't it? Oh, so good. Sliders were amazing. We had to order them twice. <laughs> uh, and the cauliflower bite. Oh, um, so good. A couple of drinks in there. Yeah, which is brilliant. It's such a great experience in there. They're so friendly, it's so chill. Um, it just takes you away from the park for a bit, but you're still in the park. It's yeah. just a really cool place. And a bit of aircon at the hottest time of day. Oh, yeah. Uh, oh. We've had to switch over to this. Uh, a different, um, yeah, we're back recording on the phone now because uh, the camera seems to have had a bit of a malfunction. Uh, we'll see what we can do about that in the next couple of days. Malfunction, I think, means buying a new camera. Uh, could very well be ordering a new camera. Day one of the holiday and the camera has done. Amazon Prime might become our friend. <laughs> uh, but now we're going to go and head over to Sorin yeah. and uh, chill out on that.
So we've just finished in the land uh, where we did soaring and living with the land. Yep. Soaring we walked on with our fast track, but we really didn't need it. It was a, it was a posted 50 minute gig. And really that's quiet. Living with the land was a walk on. Yeah. It's really quiet, really quiet fast track. Maybe we're just lucky, but it just feels really quiet on Thursday. Um, it feels though like there's a few key rides getting all of the attention and yeah. the rest of it's just such we're in the middle of the summer holiday. Test tracks at 80, and finding um, and Ratatouille's at 55. It's really it should be much busier than this, but it's really not. Which is great. It's absolutely fantastic. It is really hot. Even if the heat gets really hot, it's very warm. But you know, sun, cream, and water. Is the answer. Uh, we're off to find a new way. How? What did you think of Soaring? Oh, I, I love Soaring. Um, it, Love yeah, I think it's got the best sport anyway. Sport, yeah. The music, yeah. The music yeah. is the best music of any ride I've ever been on. And it's classic because we weren't on either edge, so everything was yeah, quite right. rightfully presented and yep. bent in the middle. <laughs> and it's, yeah, it's, I really love it. And then Live With The Land is great. It's sit down, some air con, um, go around and see what all the stuff they're doing with um, food in the park. And we'll probably go and eat some of it. I also have this little trick in my mind, like if I worked here, where would I like to work? It'd definitely be in the Live and Learn section. <laughs> Just look. Our next stop is Finding Nemo Ride. Uh, and then I think we've got Fast Fast for Mission Space Orange this time. Yeah. The more intense version. Yeah. We'll let you know how that goes. <laughs> Just 
walking around to Mission Space, and we've got our final Nemo. And Lauren has treated herself to a strawberry fruit bar. How long do you think that's going to last? It's about two seconds. It's melting. It's incredibly hot here, so it's melting quick. But we've got thunder and rain as well, so we've got heat. But the rain has cornered us down as we walk through the Moana construction site, essentially. Uh, unbelievable that this was a construction site a year ago when we visited. We spent the last 45 minutes after Mission Space walking around, did a bit of shopping. Now it's time for us to do Guns of the Galaxy. Really good, like great poster, works really well, nice and smooth. Uh, I'm a fan of the music for the I know it's okay. Had one way or another by Blondie. Yes. Yeah. Which is great. Which Matt loves. Um, yep. um, but no, really good run, really good run. So what was your favourite part? Sure. Uh -huh. I mean the Magma Launch is fantastic. Yeah. Um, and apart from that, super smooth. Always a huge win. Yeah, that's because it's new. It is super smooth. It's really well timed. There's never a job to make in it. You can just relax and enjoy it and have fun. Yep. It's the happiness ride. It makes me happy. Yep. So we've got our breath of breath to it. I like it. It's cute. It definitely, uh, definitely gets the motion sickness though. There's a couple of bits where, it's set, where you either feel like you're going too fast for the animation or the animation is going too fast for you. It's really good. Like, it works well. I know a lot of people have said they get motion sickness off this ride. Um, I, I get really there. bad motion sickness and I didn't find it too bad at all today. No. But I could see why people would struggle slightly. Yeah. But otherwise, really good. It's um, I think we're heading over to Pikmin now, uh, and then I'll walk around the World Showcase. Yeah. Maybe a little bit of food and wine. What have you gone for, Lauren? Tell us. Pork belly with black beans and pesto. Okay, go on then. Give it a go. It's a bit wet and rainy here. Yeah, the rain's. I'm just going to go. The rain's bit, arrived. That's a big bit. Yeah, yeah. Oh, nice. Yeah, you're a fan. Mm. Really nice. And I've gone for, I'm not going to attempt to pronounce it, but it's Brazilian <laughs> cheese bread uh, at the Epcot Food and Wine Festival. So uh, I've just gone and picked up for Lauren the apple strudel from Hang the- on, for Lauren? Did he say for Lauren? I think for both of us. I'll help a little bit. Uh, an apple strudel from the German um, stall in Epcot Food and Wine Festival. Uh, and at the same time, we grabbed ourselves a little. Um, this again, is the. Hang on, again. So, just the we in this occasion is for Matt. Mainly me. We're <laughs> fleeing the rain. <laughs> uh, it's coming down a little bit heavier than, it, than we hoped. Um, so, the plan is back to the hotel. Yep. Um, maybe a quick drink in the hotel bar, then Uber to Cabana Bay at Universal Studios. Yeah, hotel so, number three. Hotel in number three. three days. Yeah, we're, we're really hotel hopping at the moment. I'm looking forward to settling now. I've got to be honest. Yeah, but um, yeah, we'll we'll take you with us on our little journey. We'll let you know how we get.